cracking YouTube. It's your boy Jason Yamamoto. In today's q and I'm answering your guys' question. How, how do I deal with YouTube hate, disrespect, and ever-growing popularity? Right? A lot of people want to know exactly how I do it. And I'm going to answer this for you guys who, has, who currently has a YouTube channel and is experiencing some dislikes, some hate. Right? And I want you guys to use that energy, that negative energy, to make your, your new physical gains. That's how I've been making new gains, is uh, been taking all the factors, right, and using it to my advantage. Um, when I first started my YouTube channel, it started off as a music channel, um, discussing about current hip-hop news and, and um, top five songs of the week, month, all that other good stuff, right? And uh, as I continuously go on this path of fitness, I get a I get a couple of uh, haters here and there. You know, I get um random ass strangers leaving some rude ass comments, some rude ass opinions, right? But that doesn't really affect me anymore these days. Matter of fact, it probably affected me like maybe eight months ago, six months ago. Um, these days, it really doesn't do me good just to even care because here's the thing: if you if you notice, right? If you notice this, they'll leave you one bad comment, but then you'll never see them again. I call these guys the one-time commenter. You'll never see them again. I promise you, you'll never see them again, right? And even in real life, even if you were walking down the street and some random dudes just yelled out, Oh, fuck you, you piece of shit. Go back to where the fuck you came from. Right? And if you keep walking, you'll never see that person again. I guarantee you, you won't see him. And if you do, it was uh, fate for you to go kick his ass. Or her ass, whatever. You know? So, I think about it these days. It's like, well, you know... Should I care or should I not care? You know, I always take into consideration what they say. But if it doesn't help me in any way, then I really don't care. It's that um, quote from Bruce Lee, right? Only take the things that's going to help you. Only take the best advice or the best knowledge and use that for yourself. Everything else you just disregard, right? That's how I, I look at things now. If it doesn't help me, then fuck your opinion. That's the truth. And if it does help me, well, thank you. You know? Um, so as you continue, continuously stay on YouTube, you'll start noticing your subscribers go up, right? And then you'll start noticing you're becoming more and more popular. And you'll get a bunch of hippie motherfuckers coming through your channel to start talking shit. Right, disliking your video, and nobody likes. I, I, I'm still human. When somebody disliked my video, I was like, "Motherfucker, he disliked my video." I want to know who it was. Just let me know right now who it was exactly, right? And then you get a couple of guys who just say some nasty ass shit, and then you want to like, you know, just ah, ah, you know, just want just let them have a piece of your mind. But then I start thinking about catabolic hormones and stress stress right unneeded stress which comes from these haters you know they create catabolic hormones destroying your gains so the more positive you can be the more physical gains you can make so the challenge is whenever I see a hater comment I have to be more uh, mentally be more mentally strong and use that strength to overcome that hate or that disrespect. Because if I let that, you know, um, if I absorb that hate, right? If I absorb that hate, it's more stress comes into my bloodstream. And the catabolic hormones fuck up all my gains. And that's one thing I don't need. So, for you uh, other bodybuilders, strength athletes... Uh, strength trainers, whatever you would call yourself, crossfitters, whatever, you know, if you're into uh, weightlifting. Um, if you let these guys get under your skin, 
just know that that's unneeded stress. And us fitness guys, you know, we get all kinds of dopamine, natural dopamine that's, that's being released in, in our mind, into our body, right? Uh, that makes us happy. And the more happier we are, the more gains we make. That's the truth, right? Have you not really noticed that I've been really more cheery, more nice on behind the camera? That's the truth, man. That's the truth. And I hope you guys um, take this advice that uh, YouTube haters will help you make gains. And that's the truth. That's how I've been making more gains. Just continuously stay positive. And the more positive you stay, the more gains you make. So it's your boy Jason Yamamoto, and I'll talk to you guys later. Nice. Nice. Breathe.